Ladies and gentlemen, we are being invaded. The first sighting of extraterrestrials uh, appeared around 6 o'clock p.m. and they've been using ground tactics to wipe out the human race. Their attacks are airborne. They release a neurotoxin into the air which causes stammering, a confusion of words. If you are inside your homes, it is advised that you shut all windows and close up all air vents. I'm afraid this is a real thing. It turns people into monsters, makes them do irrational things. The neurotoxin turns people into monsters. It makes them do irrational things.
30 grand a year for this.
course, he calls me and he's not here. Why am I not surprised? The guy calls for your help. Doesn't even tell you what he wants. And, uh, doesn't even have the decency to be here. Okay, that's splendid. Let's do that. Sit <laughs> Ten years too late. Nice to meet you, Rachel. What do you like to do for fun? <sighs> You're creepy. Yeah, you hurt me, Rachel. Now I'm going to kill you.
Okay, so I'm going to try this thing out and try to document my sister's birthday party. Here she is. The big, the big one, two. Yep. She is uh, decorating her own cake. Because I like any cake. Any which way that she wants. Sweetness. So, yep. Okay. What'd you do to the candle? I broke it. Put that one there. No. You're my best friend. <laughs> oh, hi, Mark. You'll have to put them in the ice. I, I will. Yeah. So, Steven. Four. <laughs> what? Five. Um. Six. Seven. Eight. Yeah. So, this is my brother, Josh. <laughs> He's going to show me his video. On the Wii, I guess. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You too. Hey, Steven. Yeah, high def. Look at that. Oh, she's all alone. I went for a run in the hot day sun. When it's so windy, definitely not lazy. I took my steps. <laughs> my shoelace was untied. So I fell on the ground. In the grass mound. Okay, so how much time did you have on this? Okay, I wish I was awesome. Oh, wait, I already am. Yes, I wish. Make a wish. I did. Hold on, I'm gonna What'd you wish now. for? I wish I was awesome, but I already am. If you ever want to do birthday cake justice, get that. Not cake. Get this. Just nothing better. All right, I'm gonna hey, see what I'm the family name. Uh, what it is? It's not a real ladybug. Yes. What else did you get? Oh, it's covered. What is that, Amanda? It's a pillow bed. Wow. And when you were six, out of the cool. That's to replace the purple watch that I bought for you two months ago and stashed in our house. And, and it's right see? beside your card. Where your card is, that is. I can't okay. find it. So just to replace it. Sorry, you're my... That was a fail. That was a fail. Just guess what? Happy birthday. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>
This is the scene of the property. It's very good. It's freezing out here. I wouldn't have slipped on a hoodie. Yeah, it's pretty cold. I got a long sleeve shirt on too. Wanna to go see the dogs? Alright, so we're going to go see the dogs now. Haven't said hi to them in a while. Good to be back home. I don't recognize you at all. Okay, there's uh, Brittany and Missy. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with that pool? It's like nuclear green. It looks like the ectoplasm. Is everything okay? Yeah. I'm bored. How are your classes at school? I'm dropping out. You're 15 years old, you can't drop out. Are you kidding me? It's just not for me. I got I got a job at Hollister. It's better. Okay, you know. Look. You're getting an education. Okay? Whatever. Okay, look. I don't, I don't care what you say. You're getting an education. You're not dropping out of high school. Was it the math? Is it algebra? Algebra 2. English. English? You're having trouble with English? All you have to do is read. You know, I'm not like you, alright? What is that? What the heck was that? What the? Oh my god, what was that, man? What was that? What was that? Go around the other side. Go around the other side. You heard that, right? Yeah, I heard that. Did you see it? I, I don't know, maybe. I, I thought it was something. I, yeah. Did it come down from. Cause I had, yeah, 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 yeah. I heard it going that way. That, that way. Somewhere in here. I heard it going that way. I don't way. know where. It was. It was like. Oh my gosh, we are going to be YouTube sensations. Oh my gosh. Hold on, hold on. Oh my gosh. You recorded that, right? I recorded that. You've been recording everything, right? Yes. Yeah, oh my gosh. Okay, hi, hush, hush, hi. I can't see anything. Oh my god. I, I can't see anything. It's too dark. It's, it's too dark. Maybe it went somewhere else. Well, I don't... Wait, shh. You want to go in? Wait, shh. You hear that? Oh my oh, god! Run, run, run! Oh my god! Oh my god! What was that? What was that? Did you see that? Oh my gosh, the dogs are barking. Oh my gosh. I, I, oh my gosh. In the back, in the back. In the back. Car, go to the car. It's locked. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. Oh jeez. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. No. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Get in the car. Go. 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 Recording, man. We gotta leave. Quiet. Was that nice? Let's move in the car. Stop that.
Hey guys, so um, I literally just got back from a walk and uh, I came home to find this just sitting on my front porch. It's a uh, little, little garden gnome. Fits in the palm of my hand. Um, uh, didn't see a name on him or anything. Um, and uh, yeah, um, kind of looks like, kind of looks like the gnome in that movie, Amelie, where they're traveling, no, actually, you know, you know what he really looks like, he kind of looks like, uh, oh god, what was that cartoon, um, uh, David the Gnome, he looks like David the Gnome, um, you know, that, it, I think it was that old, uh, Nickelodeon cartoon, um, where he's like riding on foxes and stuff. Um, well, um, yeah, this is kind of weird. Um, well, thank you, whoever you are, for giving me this. Um, uh, thanks. Uh, I guess I'll just call you, uh, David, since he looks like David the Gnome. Um, so yeah, whoever gave me this, thank you. It's a little creepy, but thanks. Okay, guys, so I just got home from work, and uh, look what I found on my doorstep. Again, it's a, uh, another, it's another gnome. Um, again, no name. Um, so yeah, this is starting to get a little weird. Um, yeah, um... Well, I don't know who keeps doing this. Um, thank you, I guess. Um, I mean, I guess my yard could use a little, a uh, little ornamentation. Uh, here, let's. I guess just sit them next to the other one. We can put you there, I guess. Um, and uh, yeah, so I guess that's uh, that's two now that you guys have given me, whoever you are. Um, and uh, I guess this one's bigger. Um, I don't know if you're trying to tell me something, but, um, thanks again, I guess. Uh, let's see, okay, so, if that one's David, you're bigger, um, what can I call you? You're bigger, so, I guess I'll just call you Goliath, how about that? There we go, David and Goliath. There you go, that's your names. All right. Um, so, yeah, uh, I don't know who keeps giving me these, but, uh, thank you. Um, you really don't have to do that. Really, you don't. <laughs> but, um, thanks anyways. Okay, y'all, this is seriously day three of this, and now look what I found. Yes. A whole friggin' tribe of them on my front porch today. Um... Yeah, so we've got those guys, we've got these two, now we've got these guys. Um, like seriously, I don't know who's doing this, but, um, you can stop now. <laughs> it's, uh, starting to get a little weird. Um, and by a little I mean a lot, so you can stop now. Um, yeah, I, like, I don't get it. Like, are they... Are they trying to say something? I mean, I don't... God, it's like... It's like they're just staring into your soul. It's a little creepy. Um, okay, well, um, I guess we can just kind of put you guys over here with the rest of them. Why not? Um, so now there's three. Um, let's see, we got David and Goliath. I guess you... You're kind of like a hipster little school teacher looking thing, so I don't know, maybe you can be their father. You can be Jethro. You are Jethro, father of David and Goliath, I guess. Um, you're kind of a littler dude. Um, kind of hard to see there, but um, I guess since we're kind of going with uh, biblical names, we'll just call you Moses. Um, and you. Okay, now this guy, 
this guy kind of looks like that garden gnome from Amelie. Um, I don't know, I guess you can be Potiphar. Sure, you're Potiphar, and you can be Potiphar's wife. Why not? All right. Um, yeah, we'll just move uh, David over here. So, okay. Um, that's quite a bit of garden gnomes, um, whoever you are. Uh, so, let's do the roll call. I guess we got, uh, what was that, David and Goliath. And I guess their father, Jethro. Why not? Uh, we got Moses. And we got Potiphar and Potiphar's wife. Why not? Um, okay, so... Uh, please <laughs> stop sending me garden gnomes. Um, my porch is only so big. <laughs> so um, you really don't have to give me any more garden gnomes. Whoever you are, please just stop. Thank you. Alright guys, so for the past uh, three days now, I've been getting garden gnomes on my uh, front porch. Uh, so this time, I am going to uh, discover at the same time as you guys. Uh, see if I am getting more today, or if it has stopped. Um, let's give it a check-see. Alright. Um, let's do it. Alright, there we go. Let's see what we got. Alright, so, walk into the front porch, and there's those guys, still there, hi everybody, weird, and it looks like there are none today, so that's cool I guess, um, well hopefully it stopped, um, again thank you whoever was uh, leaving me those, um, you didn't really have to do that, but, um, thanks anyways. Um, oh, well, that's pretty cool, what? Um, okay, so I don't remember leaving the bathroom light on this morning, um, Okay, okay, okay. Any garden gnomes in here? Okay, wow. Um, okay, so, uh, that's a little weird. Um, I did not leave the bathroom light on this morning. I don't know why it's on now. Um, but I- Oh, shit! Oh, shit. How long has that been on? Okay, well, can't be too long. Maybe about 30 minutes, if that. Uh, okay, so I know I did not set a candle this morning before I left. Um, I'm going to go call the police now uh, because I think I may have been broken into. Okay, guys, so uh, just a little update uh, since the last video. I talked to the police. Um, we went around the house. To make a long story short, we went around the house. Uh, we could find no evidence of a forced entry or break-in. Um, where The police were just as baffled as I was. Um, no idea um, how the candle was lit uh, or why the bathroom light was on. Uh, we didn't find anything, basically. Um, so I guess that's good, maybe, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know, maybe I'm going insane for real, I don't, I don't, th I, I know I didn't light the candles, so that's still a mystery to me, I have no idea, um, uh, but in the good news, um, no garden gnomes today, so this is the third, second, second day in a row, um, no garden gnomes, nothing, Nothing new. I did. I did tell the officer about uh, the garden gnomes because they asked me if I had noticed anything uh, strange or unusual, and um, I did mention I'd been getting garden gnomes, um, but I thought it had stopped, um, and uh, <clears throat> that is true. I didn't get any garden gnomes today, so um, that's good. Um, speaking of garden gnomes, 
uh, I have been doing a little bit of reading. Turns out there is a lot you can learn about garden gnomes. Um, I don't know, I just, I, mean, <laughs> I guess you could say I was inspired um, by all these random garden gnomes I was getting. Uh, so I went to the library, picked this up. Uh, turns out there's a lot you can learn about garden gnomes. Uh, this book covers uh, lots of stuff. Um, you know, tools, things they use, their lifespan, you know, and here I just thought, you know, they're little $10 ornaments you pick up at Walmart. Apparently, no, they've, they've got a complete history of garden gnomes uh, in here. Apparently they live, um, live in the trees and live in the forests and stuff, and uh, they uh, ride foxes and they, they don't get along with trolls. Um, Obviously, this book is insane, but um, it's just, well, okay, what's insane about it is how, how detailed it gets. Um, like, it goes through virtually every aspect uh, of a garden gnome's life. Um, like, okay, here's one, here's one about their religion. Uh, this one says, um, garden gnomes are especially in tune with nature and the spirits that go unseen by mere humans. Oh, I bet. Um... <laughs> They worship a deity named uh, Gnarly Dwarf, I guess, or I guess the G is silent, so Gnarly Dwarf. Gnarly, dude! I don't know. Uh, they worship a deity named Gnarly Dwarf, seen as the Lord of all gnomes. They summon Gnarly Dwarf by gathering three or more gnomes around a candle and chanting the sacred chant of the gnomes. Um, okay, cool. Who knew? Um, so yeah, that's kind of what, uh, has been going on. Um, I just figured I'd kind of record that because I, I mean, the whole thing is just so weird. It's been so weird, you know, the garden room showing up and then the candle thing. And I just, I don't know. I just, <laughs> um, I don't know. I mean, and it's, it's almost like, it's almost like the garden gnome is making fun of me now. Nothing in the bathroom. Yep, keep that, uh, keep that guy open. Okay, hang up there. No one. Um. Okay, I didn't leave this open. Why is that open? Okay. And how the heck did these guys get in here? Um, oh. Okay, so to make another long story short, um, called the police again. Um, again, no sign of anyone in the area. Um, I locked my door uh, before I came in here to do this. Um, I don't know what the thumping and shit was, but um, we didn't see anybody on the roof, didn't see anybody outside. Um, no signs of vandalism. I don't know how the garden gnomes got in here. Uh, I have taken the garden gnomes and I have put them in a garbage bag and I threw them away. They are sitting outside in the garbage can uh, and um, hopefully that's the end of this. Okay guys, um, I've been awake for about 20 minutes now and I keep hearing this thumping, but it, it's like it's going on and off, on and off, and I don't, um, I don't know what it is. Um, the problem is my phone is in the living room, and I want to call the cops, but I have to get to it first. Um, I've been kind of working on my nerve right now. Um, see, like, it stopped. is but if it's if it's someone I'm gonna I'm gonna get them this time so let's see what happens
is this? The master is near. Yeah, um, I, t I called the police uh, again. <sighs> Nothing. Now they're starting to get, just think I'm making this up, but that's why I'm documenting this is because I'm, I'm not making this up. You have, you've watched this with me. Um, uh, I threw those garden gnomes away, okay? Okay, guys, um, it's been doing the thumping again. Uh, it has not stopped, um, tonight. It's been about 20 minutes going on now. Um, I'm gonna try and, I'm gonna try and, uh, see if I can't, um, get it this time. I don't, I don't know what the hell this is. I, I just... I need sleep. I'm, I'm, I'm going out there. I'm going out there. Coming from everywhere. What the hell is that? Oh my god. What the hell? Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Think you're real funny, don't you, huh? I'm gonna do it. Go! Okay. Alright. Okay. 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 Alright, I don't know what's going on, y'all, but, um, this is freaking me out. Um, I'm gonna get to my phone and call the. Shit! All right, well, I'm coming in there. Oh, my God. What the hell is this? What? Where are you at, you freak? What the hell is that sound? What is that? Oh my god!